State of Florida is sparking controversy tonight by rejecting a nationally recognized African American history AP course. The administration of Governor Ron DeSantis says the advanced placement class is full of critical race theory and that it doesn't tell both sides of the story. Tonight, reaction from parents and the co author of the course. Here's ABC's Ike Jachi. Tonight, Florida's Department of Education fighting back amid backlash over its decision to reject an advanced placement African-American studies course in its high schools. In a letter obtained by ABC News, officials deeming the course contrary to Florida law and claiming it significantly lacks educational value. Among the department's list of concerns, topics like movements for black lives, black feminist thought, and the reparations movement. Dr. Lisa Hill, who spent years helping craft the curriculum, says critics are misinformed and students should learn there's more to black history than slavery. It's been sanitized and in many ways erased. So, you know, trying to make sure that people understand not just the contributions that African Americans have made, but the fact that um, our history did not begin um, with enslavement. The course exploring the contributions of African Americans in fields like literature, arts and humanities, and political science. Still, the department's rejection is the latest in a growing movement in the state aimed at monitoring curriculum and conversations about race, largely spearheaded by Governor Ron DeSantis. Florida is where woke goes to die. And parents like Tina Deskovich, the founder of conservative group Moms for Liberty. We're trying to all love each other equally. And now in this class, they're telling you that colorblind is a horrible thing. It's a bad thing. You need to see the color. You need to separate people out. And, you know, we reject that. The course is currently being piloted in a small number of schools before it'll be rolled out nationwide to any school that wants to add it as an elective course. Now, while Florida does have a mandate to teach African-American history, that course will remain rejected unless the College Board decides to change the curriculum to fit the standards set by DeSantis' office. Wit. Ike Jashi, our thanks to you.